So guys, I am back with another Red 4 video. And would you believe me if I told you guys I got all of these legendary weapons from one legendary weapon spot? Well today guys, we'll explain all and how I believe you can actually do an unlimited legendary farm. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so there are spots on the Redfall map where there's actually certain guaranteed legendary weapon drops. There's one inside of this place here. There is one in a pawn shop up here. There's also one, I believe, where are we? Somewhere down there, which is the one we're actually going to... No, it's down here, sorry. Which is I'm going to showcase you today. And there's another one actually all the way over here in this building there. Uh, but if you've missed them, I've got a video which I'll link in the video description uh, which will showcase you where you get all of these guaranteed legendary weapons from. Now, back to before release where people who had early access could drop videos before the day one patch. Uh, my pal Vulcan uploaded an unlimited legendary farm where he went to one of these spots and he opened the, the safe with a lockpick and grab the legendary if he quit out of his game and come back in and went back to that safe say the legendary will be still well be there for him to grab again but he would have the one in his inventory so it's basically an unlimited farm well guys that's basically what i was doing i was doing it i did it nine times in a row until i figured out what stops it from happening and that's what i'm going to teach you today i want to try it out and let me know okay so first things first you want to come to the lost and found vendor here and make sure you have Plenty of these lock picks and plenty of these rewire kits. You may have to keep restocking these if you want to use this too. Another thing you want to make sure you do, guys, is you want to make sure you have space within your backpack. I've got 21 and 20 uh, because the way this works is you can't go into your backpack. You can't once you start this farm. You can't. I wouldn't even come on this page. I'd literally, guys. I'd, I'd, I'd avoid the law of that page whatsoever. So make sure you have as much space as you can make inside of your backpack because if you've only got 20 spaces you're only going to be able to do this 20 times to get 20 legendaries be my understanding anyway okay so this is what we do so i'm just going to use a typical spot we're going to go to this spot here which is where it's the most famous spot it's one of these here it's like a lobster house so i'm just going to mark that so i'm just going to run there guys and i'll show you exactly what i was doing and i'll show you on screen as well this i'm absolute certain works I really am certain this works and you'll see me doing it and I was doing it for literally 10-15 minutes straight and I kept coming back here and every single time I did there was a legendary weapon here for me so yes take advantage of this while you can guys so obviously still a glitch that's still in place so I'm just gonna avoid these dudes I'm just gonna go invisible because I don't want to piss about here so this is the building this is building here this is where I was doing it. But again, it will work in any spot. Any of the four I've already covered. So yes, now. If I jump through that window, it's going to set off the alarm. I'm just going to open it here. Actually, you know what? I don't care. Let's go through. Oh no, that's already open because I already popped this. Don't worry about that. But the chest will be around here. This you'll need a lockpick to get into too. And the chest is there. Now. What I was doing was, and this is exactly what I was doing, and you'll see this on screen now, I was coming up to this chest, I was using a lockpick on it, and as soon as I got that legendary weapon guys, I'd press start, go straight across to settings, and quit out of the game. Simple as that. And then, as soon as I got back into the game guys, I marked this place on the map, and come straight back here, and did exactly the same again. Open the safe with a lockpick. Grab the weapon, didn't look at the weapon, didn't go into my loadout menu at all. Uh, well, I didn't go into the loadouts of my backpack, I didn't check my backpack, I didn't hover above any of my weapons. I literally pressed start, quickly went across to settings, went down to quit out, come back in, come straight back here. And I, like I said, I did this nine times in a row before I went into my backpack to delete stuff because my stuff was full. As soon as I did this, guys, when I come back to the save, it was already opened. Now it's just either a coincidence 
but I got nine in a row. My backpack was full. I deleted the space, come back here and the safe was open. I couldn't do it anymore. I tried it in another spot guys, an accident and I got it working there. But again, then I saw a, a pistol, no actually, was, was it a pistol? Could have been a pistol I wanted, um, which are lower level now. And it worked there. So yeah, this definitely works. There's definitely a way of getting it down and that's exactly how I was doing it. I come here, open the chest, quickly grab the loot, quickly grab that legendary, press start, quit out the game, simple as that. Loaded back in, ran here from the fire uh, station, did exactly the same again and I did this nine times in a row. Nine times in a row before my backpack was full and I, I didn't know what I was doing at the time. But I realized as soon as I opened my backpack, that it's obviously the game on, it's obviously server side saving in it. So the game on their servers was saving and therefore the chest was opening. It's something to do with your backpack, something to do with going into it, being on the load that menu for too long. It's going to be something like that. So again, just do as I say and you'll get this working. Let me know how you get on down below in that comment section. I mean, if you want to hit me up on my discord, uh, you can. That is linked in the video description too. But guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it helps you out. Again, you can do this with any of the legendary loot locations. That video will be linked down below. If you've already been here and grabbed this one. So do check it out. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. And hopefully, I will see you on that next one.